Commander Baron gave an order to attack a Skynet research facility located in the old university hospital. If they managed to liberate the hospital, her soldiers could still be there. But that's a big if. I just realized that the loading symbol is the Cyberdyne symbol. Huh, no machines yet. Hey, there she is. Don't sneak up on me like that. Sorry. It's bad enough with those creepy noises. What noises? Every once in a while, there's this unbearable scream coming from that hospital. We need to see what's going on. Let's move. After you. Damn, I'm out of pipe bombs. Let me. Picking locks is kind of my thing. Voila. I wasn't looking. Don't judge me. Oh, jeez. Looks like a silverfish got him. Every scavenger's nightmare. Ooh, look, this poor guy is still holding a sound decoy. Sound decoy? You resistance guys just shoot at everything that moves, don't you? Silverfish are sensitive to noise, so before it pops up from the ground and starts chasing, you throw a sound decoy. It'll draw any nearby silverfish away. I guess you can take it. He won't be needing it anyway. Did you hear that? That's the sound I was talking about. I don't think you should go any further. And what about you? I have to go. That could be the resistance. I understand. I uh, feel stupid asking you this, but Aaron wanted me to find some antibiotics for Mark. <sighs> I know I'm not making it easy on you, but if you're in there and you find some cheap, we would really appreciate it. I'll Consider it done. I can do. And I'll remember find it. that your gun won't do you any good against Terminators. So when you see one, do what I do. Sneak past them. I'll be waiting for you at the hideout. Take care. I will. Don't worry. But thanks for the info on the Terminators. That sound is a little... You! Right now, you need to start answering some questions. There will be a time for that, but right now, you need to help the people inside. As for Colin, there was nothing I could have done. It was either him or you. And it couldn't have been you. Hello? I'm just glad we saved my tin can. Now let's keep moving. Silverfish. Huh. So that's how you stop them. They'll roll at you. Another silverfish. Come on, start rolling. And once they start rolling, it's a one shot kill. Come on. There it goes. And it looks like there's three, four more around here. There you go. Shoot any machines that you don't have to. Let's get that hacking device. Come on. Ah, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, ah, 
come on. Really? I still think it would work even if it was broken like that. There it goes. I got it. more pipe bombs, which I can't make because I'm not high enough skill level. <sighs> that sucks. Sound decoys. Hacking device acquired. You can now hack scan at terminals and turrets. This is it. Now let's get past those silverfish. There are, it looks like, three more. Oof. A little too close for comfort if I do say so myself. Great. Armored spider. He's done. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Too far. Not really the best of aim, even though it has a mini gun. Even then, I got its friend. Silverfishes. Here we go. I count five. Crap. Here we go. <laughs> That's it. I'm surprised only two activated. All right, come on. Damn. Literally just sticks on you and blows up. Come on, let's get in there. Maybe we can save them. Whoever's left, I mean. Turrets. Sounds nearby. Gotta take that turret. I wonder if I could control those turrets with the hacking device. That's what I was thinking. Because if we take out that turret, it could keep an eye out for us while we search for the meds. You don't see me. Alright, let's see. How do we do this? Hack Skynet devices, you have to move your icon to the right side of the screen while avoiding firewalls. Reaching the middle line saves your progress. Every collision into a firewall will cost you one attempt point. Losing all attempt points means failure. The number of allowed attempt points depends on your hacking skill. Right now we have five. Right, here we go. I'm not going to say anything. That's why. There you go. Turret's mine. Sweet, now it'll watch my back while I do this. Oh, 
combat stimulant. Different stimulants can enhance your speed, toughness, or reflexes for a short period of time. To use combat stimulants, assign them to the defensive item slot and press triangle. Got a new skill point. Alright, let's see. Now that we have hacking in the mix. I still think toughness. And then we'll do hacking. Weapons are good. The reason why I kind of want to do more weapons is because look, level 12 and weapon 3 allows us to use first generation plasma weapons or red. So maybe if we kill one of these terminators, we can take their gun and use it against them. You stay on guard, sentry. I'll be right back. Damn it. Got it. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Boom. We're in. All right, I got two sentries on my scope. Move, move, move. Wait. Go. Take over the sentry. Got it. Uh huh, uh huh. Ah! Come on. Got it. That turret's mine. Who wins? Mine or his? Mine! Hell yeah. You know, mine did have a late start, but I still got the kill. Nice. I hear an armored spider. But he's probably not alone. Sentry gun. Okay, let's see. I see two sentry guns with an armored spider patrol in the area. Let's go. Okay, wait. Sentry's coming around. Okay, there it goes. Alright, let's take over this turret. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh-huh. 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 Ah! Ruin my groove. You ruined my groove! Sorry. Oh, it's not you ruined. It's you threw up my groove. To help. Come on, it was two on one. There we go. We had to help. It's two on one. We had to help. All right, let's keep going. Oh, how nice! They left the door open for me. That's not good. Whoa. This is, uh... Dear Maria, this might be my last letter to you. Until recently, the machines have tried to keep us alive. They were treating us like some sort of test subjects. We were valuable to them. But all they've been doing lately is exterminating the entire cages. I don't know why. But it's like we're no longer of any use to them. Like they found what they've been looking for, and now they're coming. So dramatic. Hmm. 
All right, where were we? Still making our way inside this facility. Looks like we're going up. Quiet in here. Too quiet. I don't know what gun is appropriate right now. He was part of the resistance. He's from Wait the a resistance. minute. The others have to be here too. Wait a minute. I know that face. This is the model they. This is the person they used to make the T2 model. The. The liquid metal. T1000. This is the person they used. A resistance fighter. It all makes sense. Stay alert. There's gotta be more than one terminator around here somewhere. Got it. Lots of supplies. A uh, med kit too. So technically a large med kit. Med kit one. Guess we go this way. Terminators inbound. Yeah, keep on walking, Ten Head. Like Jennifer said, my weapons won't be able to do anything against those tin heads. Unless we can get ourselves our hands on a plasma rifle. Didn't do anything. walking away coast seems clear let's keep moving forward boys <gasps> come on keep going all right see ya Too close. Come on, walk away, Ten Head. Ah, damn it. Come on. Damn it. Got it. More meds. Prognosis. Symptoms depression, anxiety, tendency for violence. 
Delusions, diagnosis, acute. Whoa. Prognosis, delusional architecture is fairly unique, but it shows signs of deterioration. I'm very, in I'm very much interested to see how the patient will react when nothing occur occurs on the morning of supposed end of the world. Signed, Dr. Silverman. Wait a minute, this hospital. Sarah Connor. This hospital must have been the mental institution that kept Sarah Connor in because they thought she was crazy for believing in the end of the world. Judgment Day. <laughs> That's so very wrong now, is she? I saw that red laser. Here he is. Come on, knock down this hallway. Come on, ten head. If it wasn't because my weapons wouldn't do anything to you, I'd blast the hell out of you. That's right, keep walking. Metal head. Still sneaking around. Something. He's coming back. I'd say we got ourselves out of dodge. Where's Tin Head? Okay, he's going away. Then we can open this door really quick. Private Jacob Rivers, Pacific Division. Pacific? What the hell happened up there? The whole division went silent. It was wiped out. I'm the only one who survived, and I need to meet with Commander Baron. All right, I'll make sure you get to do that. But first, get us out of here. Follow that staircase. It'll lead you to the main generator. Overload it, and turn off the laser grid. Understood. And Rivers, destroying that generator will make a lot of noise. So in case we get separated, where are you stationed? Just south from here. Okay, we'll find you. Baron will want to meet you. Now go, and watch out for those medals. You got it. I'll get you guys out of here. Just hold tight. Met me up. Alright, these must be the power lines. And they lead that way. Here we go. Now this area seems clear. Stay alert, man. All right, so we got a T-800 and a plasma turret behind that gate. What's in here? We can hack it. All right. There's gonna be a lot of hacking in this video. Shoot. Boop. Boop. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Ah, you threw off my groove. Ah, two left. Ah, that's one. Got it. Plasma cells, plus 27. Red plasma cells, that's good. Uh, inventory. All right, we're okay. All right, let's move. So we're gonna try and take that turret. We can take the turret. Maybe we'll have something good on our side. Alright, 
let's see. If hacking becomes re like very redundant, like it keeps doing this, then I'll just skip the hacking. For now, we'll do this one. We're through. Make it easy on myself. I see where this vent will lead me. Okay, it puts us near the turret. I see it. There's a T-800 right there. Got it. Uh-huh. 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 Got it. Take that out. Take that out. Take that out. Take it out. Take it out. Yeah. Sit down, stupid. Eat that metal head. Sadly, I can't use it because Skynet technology weapons three skill required. Damn it! This thing's kind of weak. Damage-wise, it's pretty good, but shots to overheat is 15. There's another turret coming up around the corner. Them up, turret. Messed them up. <laughs> oh, I love it when a plan comes together. Machines, I swear. So dumb. I'll take one more. Bring it into the hideout. Give it to them. Fighting chance. Inventory. Full on inventory. Damn. Alright. Uh, that really means I need backpack. Yeah. Quests. Hospitality. Looks like we're doing good. Hang on. Uh, what was it? Archives. Here we go. Uh, notes. 2 and 32. I'm on my way out. Good job. I can see the soldiers leaving. But don't think it's done. Skynet's sending reinforcements. Oh, cool. Well, they're gonna have a hella surprise waiting for them. Nothing yet. 
Six are gonna have a turret to deal with. Two or three, actually. <laughs> keep going. A little nervous. I have a feeling that the stranger is John Connor. Been protecting me. Cause how did he? How does he know about Barrett? I don't know. I'm just. It's just a guess. I honestly have no clue. Just a wild guess. Yes. My search is finally over. The soldiers I rescued from that old university hospital will deliver the message up to Commander Barrett that I need to meet with her. The only thing I have to do now is to wait. accomplished. Oh, thank God, you're finally here. How did it go? Did you find the soldiers? I did. I helped them escape from that hospital. You don't give up on your people, do you? I like that. So what now? They're supposed to come for me soon. Great. That means that you're going home? No more scavengers constantly nagging you to do things for them? Bet you like the sound of that. Oh, Erin's still up too. Go talk to her. She won't admit it, but she was just as worried as I was. Do you need help with anything? <laughs> Is that your best pickup line? Sorry, that was a bad joke. I, I tend to do that when I'm stressed. I think I got it from my dad. Better that than his mustache, right? Oh, I'm sorry, don't mind me. What was he like? He was a kind and hard-working man. But he was clever, too. He would constantly come up with these intricate ways to get me to help out. This one time, when I was little, he wanted to make a huge sign that said, Welcome, on the side of our house in Pasadena. So he said, I bet you can't spell that. <laughs> and of course I had to prove him wrong. Believe me, now I know how stupid that was. Not at all. That was very clever. Yeah. He was always full of bright ideas. Thanks for trying to make me feel better. After Judgment Day, my dad turned our house into a safe haven. A home for everyone who lost theirs. We were like a family with an endless supply of uncles and aunts. I guess my father wanted to help with the war. We never really used guns. So the only thing we could do was to help others in need. Seems like he helped a lot of people. He did. Right till the very end. Anyway, it was actually really cool. Everybody loved him, and he loved having them around. 
I think it's because he always had a brand new audience to listen to his bad jokes. <laughs> he had this really terrible one. He'd walk into the room and ask if anyone had seen his remote because his team was playing. <laughs> I always laughed at it. I'll never understand why. Sounds like a champion of dad jokes. He may have coined the term. I was begging for him not to find a whoopee cushion on a scavenger hunt. He'd literally get a heart attack from the excitement. <laughs> Look at me, Abby. I'm sorry, you probably have enough on your plate. Anyway, thanks. It's really nice to have someone to talk to. Honestly, you can talk to me about anything you want. Boo. Don't judge me. I'm I'm a man as the next man next to me. Alright. Here you go guys. Bet you guys a plasma. Yep. Uh, I don't have a freaking skill point. There's Ryan. Passed out of sleep. I'm gonna close this door. I'm just checking up on everyone. <gasps> if you guys want to read it, then just go ahead and pause the video. I know I've been reading most of them, but this one was just like... Meh. <laughs> Must be Mark passed out of sleep. Puppy. Man's best friend. No need to worry. I'm fine. <sighs> Who said I was worried? I've been thinking a lot about it, and if I can, I've decided to join the Resistance. I'll do more good there than here. Agreed. I'm glad to hear that. I just hope you're better supplied over there than we are. Speaking of which, I see you've got those antibiotics I asked for. Good. Now I can call Ryan off. I asked him if he brought a shovel with him. If you think that was too morbid, he said that after Judgment Day, digging graves was one of the few things he actually got better at. Damn. Into the storm. Yes! Two skill points. Uh, not there yet. Mm, backpack for sure. Um Yeah. Then I'll do crafting and hacking. But now I want to go and try and open this door over here now that I have it. Locked from the other side. I saw the door and I was just like, what What do I need? Medium. Alright, here we go. Nope. Ah, broke. Ah, damn it. Oh, hello. Got it. Whoa. Hey, no pinball machine. See you later. I know I promised to stay awake, but I'm getting tired. Wake me up when you get back from the hospital. I'm gonna close my eyes for a moment. Guess that's him. Never got to wake up. Wars take a toll on people. Whoa, good stuff. Lots of good stuff in here. Hmm. Oh, 
Hope that guy got to rest in peace. I guess now we got to hit the sack. See you guys in the morning. <laughs>